Melky Cabrera and the Giants trying to snap an eight-game losing streak to division rival Arizona, and Cabrera gets things going in the right direction. Top of the first, a solo blast off of Patrick Corbin makes it one nothing Giants. Bottom half of the first, Willie Bloomquist trying to answer for the D-backs, but Angel Pagan has a beat on it in deep center, and he makes the leaping grab on the warning track. Pagan crashes into the wall and holds on. Bottom three, still one nothing Giants, but two on, one out for Bloomquist, and this time Bloomquist would not be denied. A single to left off Madison Bumgarner, scores Gerardo Parra, and we're all tied at one. Fifth inning now, still tied. Man on third for Miguel Montero. Montero goes deep in the left field, and Brett Pill cannot make the over-the-shoulder grab. That scores a run to make it a 2-1 Diamondbacks lead. Very next batter is Paul Goldschmidt. And the 0-2 pitch is swung on and a drive and a deep left. Hill can go back as far as he wants, and he won't get it, because it's gone for a two-run homer for Paul Goldschmidt, his second of the year, his first since opening day, and it's 4-1 D-backs in the fifth. KTAR with the call. Bottom of the sixth now, A.J. Pollock gets into the act for Arizona. There's a drive into left field off the bat of Pollock, and that ball is gone, and A.J. Pollock's got his first major league home run to make it 5-1 D-backs in the sixth. KTAR with the call again, special moment for Pollock. Then he gets the silent treatment in the dugout before his teammates mob him. Good feeling for the Diamondbacks as they go on to beat the Giants by a final of 5-1. Arizona rookie Patrick Corbin pitches seven innings and allows just one earned run to pick up his second win of the year. And Madison Bumgarner has a five-start win streak snap. Both of his losses this season have come against Arizona.